what's up guys welcome back to another video of dynamic tech so first of all thank you so much for clicking on my video and today i'm gonna tell you about five things that should be avoided while using your computer so what are those things let's find out so the biggest mistake i personally noticed is that most people put their computers to sleep after using them but that's not the way how you deal with it after using you should not put your computer to sleep because the biggest disadvantage of sleep is that it uses 50% up to your cpu memory and even hdd and you can also read the description of the sleep by yourself from here the pc stays on but uses low power apps stay open so when the pc wakes up you're instantly back to where you left off which means your device is not at rest and it does not get a break. Instead of putting your computer to sleep, you should always shut down your computer because it will get a rest and will be life gained. When it comes to shutting down your computer, mostly people shut down their computer from the start and power options or from the right click of the start, which is not the best way to do it because from the start, Windows command our computer to shut down which is not a good way. Instead of doing this, you should hold Alt from your keyboard and press F4. And from here you should shut down your computer because this is the way you should shut down your computer. You can also read what you want the computer to do. Which means our computer commands Windows to shut down and this is the most convenient way. The next thing you should avoid doing is that opening more than one application because what do mostly people do they just open the application and then minimize it and then opens the new one which is not the good way it affects your performance and your pc gets laggy so i would recommend you to close all the applications from the taskbar as well as from the tray icon from here you should check the applications or software which are running background the next thing you should avoid doing is exceeding your CPU and memory usage up to 99%. So how do we check it? Simply go to your taskbar and from here right click anywhere and then click on task manager and you will be headed to a pop up window like this. From here keep checking your CPU and memory usage. My CPU is exceeding 50 to 60% because right now I am using OBS Studio which is recording my screen. So you should keep monitoring memory and CPU usage and take care that this does not exceed from 99%. If you have downloaded a new game or any software, then launch the game or software and then check from here that your CPU and memory are below 99%. The last and biggest thing you should avoid I would like to mention Xbox Game Bar. Because it sounds crazy when hearing about Xbox Game Bar, it records your gameplays, captures screenshots and moreover things but you should always avoid turning it on because it affects only not your gaming experience, it also affects your computer using experience while you're not gaming. Yes, while you're not gaming, it also affects your computer experience smoothness and you will feel laggy and heaviness in your computer using experience so i would recommend you to turn off this option hope you found the video helpful and if you did then give it a thumbs up and if you're new on the channel then consider subscribing also turn on the bell notification to get notified for all the videos i upload on youtube from my channel and if you have any pc problems or suggestions then let me know in the comments so i can help you that's all for today guys Thank you so much for watching.